If you want to seriously impress someone with an Excel skill, do this kind of visual query that highlights cells on your data set. To start up with, let's create a drop down list for the financial element. Select cell C3, Data, Data Tools, Data Validation. Click on the setting tabs, go to lists, and then source will be from C5 to C36 and hit enter twice. Next, we'll create a drop down list for the month. Simply go to cell D3 and follow the steps on the screen and make sure that their source is from D5 to J5. Next, let's write a formula to dynamically populate the result cell. We will use the mesh function to find the position for the month of May in our month range. This is essentially going to be our column index in our VLOOKUP function. In our VLOOKUP function, the first argument will be the financial element followed by the array containing the financial element. The third argument is going to be the output from the mesh function. And we will select false for exact match as our fourth argument. In the next part, I'll demonstrate how to dynamically highlight the cell corresponding to the result cell. Stay tuned for that.